Hello, I'm Quinn Keon. And I'm Rich Smith. And this is Real Real Hunting. All right, so let me get you caught up here on our day. Um, currently up in the UP, Mackinac County. Just got done working uh, at my firearm deer spot. I uh, got the feeders going, checked on my food plots. It didn't grow at all, unfortunately. And um, now the work's done, and I've got my youngest son, Gavin, with me, and he's really taken an interest in hunting this year. So he's getting some woods time in and the weather's horrible it just quit raining it's been raining today it's 47 degrees it's blowing like crazy but uh, we're gonna go out and look for some red squirrels and see if we can get him a shot at something he's already got one he got one while I was filling the first feeder and uh, of course we didn't have the camera rolling then so we'll see what we can find Uh, right here, big tree, big tree, halfway up. Okay. All right, we're going to hop in the truck and drive over to another spot that has been good for red squirrels in the past. So we'll check back. Ready on, on the log. Let me hold the gun. I shot at a grouse when there was three of them. I found two of them and spooked them um, again. And the third one just disappeared. But now I have two red squirrels. Take your time. Okay, I see him coming down. Shoot, now. Right behind him. He's coming down. I'm going to cut him off. What? He's coming your way. Shoot him. Yeah. Coming down the trunk. Going across. Right. 
You shot right behind him last time, G. Where'd he go? Shot G, I saw that one. There's another one over there. Come on, let's go get him. It's by the end of the birch log. Last I saw him. What follow the birch log? All right, show us what you got and tell them what's been going on. Speak well, up. We've been chasing lots of squirrels in here when we thought there was going to be no squirrels in here. But we keep on hearing them and hearing them. We keep on going after a whole bunch of them. And I finally connected with this one. And yeah, my third red squirrel of the day. Good shot, G. Another one bites the dust. Oh. I think we're going to have a meal. That one was sneaky, wasn't Listen it? Listen to all of them. What was that? All right, Gavin, good job. Yeah. Oh, it's almost like his head. That's all you need. Yeah. Fort squirrel. All right, guys, it's about 6 p.m., and I'm driving out one of my favorite two tracks in the whole wide world. And this particular two track has my secret red squirrel spot on it, or as we don't call them red squirrels, we actually call them lunch. And uh, you know, I had a great time today. Got all the work done that I had to get done. Had a few hours to spend with my kid. And uh, I think he did a real good job today. You know, if you've got a kid that wants to have some experience, whether it be shooting, whether it be hunting, you know, try to make the effort to take a little bit of time and give them that experience. Gavin's been really on the fence about whether or not he really wanted to hunt anything. He loves to fish, he loves the outdoors, didn't know if he wanted to hunt, and I've said, you know what, that's okay. If you decide you wanna hunt, that's okay, and if you don't, it's okay. And this year, he's really shown an interest in it, and now in a week's time, he's gotten his first deer, which he got last Saturday. He's got his first squirrel, he shot four red squirrels today, and he got a shot at a grouse, so. He's having a blast. I'm having a blast hanging out with my kid. And uh, now we got to get home. And uh, tomorrow's, tomorrow's a lot of fun for me because tomorrow archery season opens. And I just can't wait. So hopefully we got some good video coming up. And uh, thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time.